Coverage of the protests that have broken out all across the country after the death of George Floyd in Minneapolis. Those protests turning violent right here in the city of Syracuse. We've got live team coverage tonight, but we're going to start with News Channel Lines. Josh Martin, he's live in downtown Syracuse for us this morning. Josh, you've been with uh, this evening, rather. You've been with the protests here this evening. Uh, describe them for us. Jeff, as you can see, there aren't any protesters behind me. Right now, they're making their way around the city. But for most of the afternoon, they were right here on State Street, where we saw a lot of the events happen last night. Today, very peaceful. Several speakers taking over the microphone, delivering messages to the crowd. Two of those speakers were Syracuse Police Chief Kenton Buckner and Syracuse Mayor Ben Walsh, both of them getting right in the middle of a large group of protesters, listening to them, speaking to them. Mayor Walsh had a message, and I want to read it here. He had a lot to say, but at one point he said, quote, we need to be honest with ourselves and with you about the systematic racism that has plagued our country for its entire existence. There was mixed reaction to both men when they were standing in the crowd. Some people willing to listen, some people not wanting to hear what both had to say. Right now, protesters making their way around the city, but as I see to my left, there's a pizza and uh, water here, so it appears they'll be making their way back here to the public safety building, back here on State Street. Mayor, Mayor Walsh and Chief Buckner spoke today. We're going to get to that soon, but right now we want to send it back to Jeff in the studio. And Josh.